Renovations are underway at our Albuquerque Sunport. You're going to notice some temporary walls blocking off demolitions happening inside businesses that used to be right there in front of the TSA checkpoint. And those lines right there, that tape on the ground, well, those are where walls will be going up in just the coming months. Now, some port officials say the massive terminal renovation will reimagine concession and retail experiences inside New Mexico's largest airport. But just building new areas for businesses is the first step. They still have to fill those spaces, and officials say they want local businesses definitely in the mix. Griffin Rushton shows us how some port leaders are laying the groundwork to make sure even mom and pop shops have a chance to expand there. I think what we can have and, and what we plan to have is a world-class airport. A massive $85 million renovation project inside the Sunport is already off the ground. And now, airport leaders are setting their sights on what the final destination will look and feel like. Modernization is not about changing the character. It's really about thinking through how the passenger experiences the Sunport, step by step. Officials say there's a big focus on reimagining the concession and retail experience, and that includes bringing in new local businesses. You know, we want to we want to bring in the flavors of New Mexico, those local flavors, and represent the local business community in that way. The Sunport recently launched this website to make the process a little easier. It's a one-stop shop for everything businesses need. To to know about operating at the Sunport and what it'll take to secure a spot inside the renovated terminal. So we want to provide that kind of support because operating in an airport is different than operating out in the city. You know, there's, there are different requirements for logistics and security and so forth. The website also includes information on the DOT's Airport Concessions Disadvantaged Business Enterprise Program which is designed to level the playing field for smaller businesses. You know, that program will help us to really help shape and define the sense of place that we take so much pride in. The official bidding process is expected to start early next year, and some port leaders say the full renovation could be done by the end of 2024. In Albuquerque, Griffin Rushton, KOB4. We put a link to the Sunport's new business website at KOB.com. Officials are hosting a webinar this Friday morning to talk about that disadvantaged enterprise program. We have details for that at KOB.com as well.